Semester 4 exam review, grade 2 English. Okay. Part A. Read life in a bay, then answer the questions that follow. So now we're going to read a passage. Okay, and we try to pay attention to the little details in the passage. Then we're going to answer the questions about the story. Okay, let's start reading. Mia, start. Life in a bay. I live near a bay. A bay forms where a river meets the sea. Salt water and fresh water mix. I stop at the bay after school. Bay soil is good for plants. The plants' roots are Buried. Buried or covered by mud. Very good. Now let's continue reading. Leia, you can start. I also see. No, read first the heading. A good place for animals. A good place for animals. A good place for animals. I also see lots of difficult animals. Different animals. Different animals. Some animals come from rivers. Others come from the sea. From the sea. From the sea. I see many fish today. Small fish like to plain water. Like the calm water. Calm water. Larger. Larger fish move to the sea. What do you mean by calm water? Okay, so what do you mean by calm water? Uh, straight water. Like water with no waves like the sea, okay? Yeah. More like the river. All right. Ali, continue reading. Last paragraph. I see many the last paragraph. Some birds eat the plants in a bay. Others eat the fish. I see... Herons. Herons standing in the water. They are eating fish. I could, could. I could stay here. Here all day. Okay, very good. Question one. Write the correct answer on the space provided. Base your answers on the story Life in a Bay. Okay. A. Read it, Adam. Form. Where does a bay form? How do we start our sentence? A bay forms So a bay forms Where does it form? Where does a bay form? Yes, Leia. Where a river? The what? A river is here. Mix words together. Sea. Yes, where a river meets meets the sea. Okay. Excellent. Where a river meets the sea. Okay. What is the main idea of the story? Raise your hands. Yes, Dima. Life in a bay. Excellent. Life in a bay. Okay. Underline the word that means almost the same as buried. Which word in the text means almost the same as buried? Okay, so what's the word? Okay, so we go back to the passage, passage and circle the word covered. Underline. Underline, yes, excellent. Underline the word covered. Which is? Okay.
What do small fish like about a bay? Yes, Diva. Larger water. Larger fish move to the sea. Small fish, what do they like? Very good. Small fish like the cold, like calm water. So small fish like calm water. What do herons eat in the bay? What do they eat? Yes, Dima. They eat uh, fish. Yes, very good. Small fish. Herons eat fish. Very good. Okay, question two. Complete the sentences using the words in the box. Now, we took all these words in class before, right? Okay. Uh, let's read. The first word is dash. What's the meaning of dash? Dash, run. Run, run quickly. Yes, move, quickly yes, move quickly or run quickly. Okay. Plenty. Many. Yes, okay. Dangerous. Dangerous. No. Something that causes what? It is what? What's the meaning of dangerous? Something that causes harm. Okay, harm. Ashamed. What do you mean by ashamed? Ashamed. It means like shy or embarrassed about something. Okay? Lessons. Lessons. No. Lessons. Lessons. Lessons are things that we learn, right? Yeah. Like subjects, like maybe a game, like anything, or sports, or anything, okay? Uh, the first one. Okay, yes, read it. I learned many at school. Okay, which word are you going to choose? Lessons. I learned many lessons at school, very good. So we write here, lessons. And we cross the word. The next one, I read it. A lion is a animal. Okay, which word? Ashamed. No. A lion is a shy or embarrassed animal. Do you think a lion is shy? Yes, Adam. Dangerous. Yes, dangerous. A lion is a dangerous animal. Okay, see? Yes. Hassan? The bed was wet. She had to school. Yes, which word are we going to use? That she was late, so she had to move, go quickly to school, okay? Yeah. Okay. Nabil, do uh, D. Letter D. Okay, which word are we going to choose? Plenty or ashamed? Plenty. What do you mean by plenty, Nabil? What's the meaning of plenty? What's the meaning of plenty? Many. Many. Yes, yes. Okay. So we have many books to read at the library. Okay, the last one, Danny. Felt. Embarrassed and. About? Read it. Embarrassed and? And ashamed, that's correct. About what? About not? Can you see the board? About not? 
Telling, yes. Very good. Embarrassed and ashamed. Okay. Question three. Write a sentence using the word enjoyed. What's the meaning of enjoyed? Yes. What's the meaning of enjoyed? Leia, what's the meaning of enjoyed? No, what is it? When you enjoy something, do you like it or you hate it? Like it. Okay. Yes, you feel happy doing this thing, okay? Yes. You you enjoy doing something means you like doing this thing. Okay. A sentence using this word. Raise your hands. Okay. Yes, Ali. I enjoyed. I enjoyed what? Swimming. I enjoyed swimming. Very good. You can also say I enjoyed swimming at the beach. Okay. Very good. Question four. Read each row of words. Circle the long A, E, I, O, or U word and write it on the line. Then underline the letters that spell the long A, E, I, O, or U sound. So when you when you read the words and you hear any of these sounds, what do you do? We circle the word. And then where do we write it? After we write it on the line, what do we do? Yeah. Underline the what? Yes, Nora, what do we underline? We underline the letters that what? The letters that make the sound. Okay? For example, I'll give you an example that is not here. If I say the word cane, okay, C A N E. This is along what? A. Long A, cane. So if this word is here, we circle cane and then we write it on the line. And which letters do we underline? A, a N, E. Yes, because A and a consonant and E, so we underline A, N, E. Do you understand it now? Okay. So let's do the first one. Selena, yes, you can start. Read the first row. God. Okay. Which word has a long sound? A, E, I, O, U. Train. train. Excellent. So we circle train. And we write it here. What do we underline? Which letters? A, I. Very good. Because they spell the long A sound. The next one. Hussain. Yes, read. When sad they get. Which word? They. they. Excellent. It's they. Which letters do we underline? EY. Very good. C. Uh, okay, Adam. Yes. C. Fine. Fine. Yes. Okay, which word has a long sound? Read them again. Fine. Read them again. Fine, yes. Has been sung. Okay, where do you hear a long sound? Do you hear A or I or O or U or E? Fine. Fine. Which sound do you hear? I. I. Very good. Fine. So we circle fine. We write it here on the line. What do we underline, Adam? I and E. Okay? Because the I, consonant E, make the long I sound. Okay? The next one. Jud. Read D. Jud, start reading. Top. Phone. 
Ten. Ten. Okay, so top, hold, not, ten. Do you hear a lot, uh, the A, E, I, O, or U sound in any of these words? Is it top or phone or not or tin? Okay, so which word should? Is it top or phone? Raise your voice. Phone. Phone, very good. So we circle phone. And where do we write it? On the line, okay? No. Jude, which letters do we underline? Can you see the board? Yes. Which letters do we underline? <laughs> Nabil, which letters do we underline? O, -E. o yes, O and E, okay? Very good. Next one. Danny, yes. Say them again and raise your voice. Jump. Team. Okay, run, swim, jump, team. Which word? Team. Team, very good. It's a long what? Team. No, it's a long, which sound do you hear in team? E. e, team. Okay, so we write it on the line. And you underline which letters? E, e A, very good. Now, the next one, Dima. One, and three, next, well. Okay. Which word? Free. Free. Very good. What sound does it make? Free. E. E. Okay. Uh, which letters uh, spell the long E sound? E. 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 Very good. So we underline E. E. Okay. The next one, Ibrahim. Okay, Ibrahim, read the this row of words. Okay. Ibrahim, read. Ink. Fin. Okay, ink, fin, us, use. Which word has a long sound? Use. Use, very good. So a circle, use. And which letters make the long U sound? U. Yes, U consonant E. So we just circle. This time we underline the whole word. Okay. The next one, Mia. Away. Adrian. Bring. And. Okay. Which word has a long sound? Away. Away. Very good. So we circle. Away. Okay, what are the letters that make the long A sound? A Y. A Y, very good. Part B, question one. Complete each sentence with the noun in parentheses. Write the plural form of the noun. So what we have between parentheses here are nouns, and we need to change them to their pl plural form. Okay. So usually when we change a noun to its plural form, what do we add? Uh, e -S. Okay, we add S or E-S. Or if it ends with a consonant Y, we cross the Y. Okay, we cross the Y and add I-E-S. Now, some nouns, we do not add to them S-E-S or I-E-S. What do we do? We change the spelling of the word, okay. And some words, some nouns, do they change in their plural form? No. Some of them don't change, okay? So let's start here. A, Ali, read A. Okay, berry. How do we change berry to its plural form? Berries. Berries, very good. How do we spell berries? I-E-S. Okay, we cross the Y and put I-E-S because what's before the Y? Consonant. 
a consonant. A consonant. R is a consonant. Okay. Uh, next one. Okay. Hassan. He told the other foxes. He told the other foxes. Okay. So what do we add here? S or E S? Yes. Why did we add yes? Because, because fox ends with the what? With, with the letter X. Okay? Yeah. Now, next one, Dima. The tree were too high. Okay, what's the noun? Branch. branch. Okay, the tree branch. Now, how do we change branch to its plural form? Branches. Branches. What do we add? Yes. Okay, why did we add the S to branches? CH, okay? Because it ends with, the noun ends with CH. Okay? Next one. Brahim. Read it. Okay, read it. Playing. Playing and the yard. yard does night. No. no. Cat. The nerve cat. How do we change it to its plural form? What do we add to it? S. S. Only S. Thank you. So it is cats. Okay. E. Mia. The beautiful lives in the zoo. Okay. Deer. How do we change deer to its plural form? The beautiful deers. No. How do we change it? So how do we change deer to its plural form, Mia? It stays the same, yes. Very good. It stays the same. Do the next one as well. Read the next one. The are under the floor. Mouse. Okay. Mouse. How? So how do we change mouse to its plural form? Mice. Mice. How do we spell mice? M-I-C-E. Okay. Next one, Leah. Without? Without tooth. Okay, how do we change tooth to its plural form? Toothes? No. No. Teeth. Teeth. Very good. Excellent. Teeth. Adam, the last one. Okay, read it, Adam. Live in the sea. Okay, so the word is fish. How do we change it to its plural form? It stays, it stays, it stays the same. So fish live in the sea. Very good. Question two. Underline the present tense verb that agrees with the subject. Now, we know that... Uh, the present tense, the word stays the same. But when we have a singular subject, we, we do some changes, okay? Now, the first one. Okay, Adam, read the first sentence. The girl sees the moon. Okay, the girls see or sees the moon. Now, let's, where's the subject, Adam? Girls, okay, read well. Girls, girls is plural or singular? Plural. Plural, okay. So, when we have a plural subject, the present tense verb, does it change or stays the same? Stays. Yes. So, is it C or C's? C. C, very good. Next one, Selena. 
Read it, please. It look or looks big and white. Okay? No. Yes, the subject is it. We're talking about the moon, all right? So the moon singular, right? When we have singular, what do we add to the present tense verb? S. Okay, so we, we, you chose look or looks? Looks, very good. Very good. It looks big and white. Okay. The next one, Naveel, read it. A star shoot, shoots the okay, where's the subject, Naveel? The subject, not the verb. What is the sentence about? It's talking about what? The star. Okay, a star. So a star is our subject because the sentence is talking about a star. Now, so a star is singular or plural? Singular. Very good, singular. So when we have a singular subject, the present tense verb, we add S or not? Yes. We add S. Okay, so is it shoot or shoots? A star shoots. shoots across the sky. Very good. Okay. Yes, same. Read it. Darkness. Okay, so it, it is singular or plural? Singular. singular. Very good. So it flash or flashes? Flashes. Flashes, very good. We added here ES. Good job. Question three. Write the past tense verb to complete each sentence. The verb is the one between parentheses, okay? In the past tense verb, what do we add to the verb? ED. ED, okay. Say, so read the first one. Tom. Tom. Recess. Okay, so we have the verb play. How do we make it in the past tense? Played. Very good. So we add ed. Okay, the next one. Hassan? He take on. This is talk, not take. Talked on the phone. He talked on the phone, very good. Okay, Leia? I. I think. Wait. Oh, yes, okay. Ten minutes for the bus. I ten minutes for the bus. Okay, the verb is what? I wait ten minutes for the bus. Okay, wait. How do we change it to the past tense? Add ed. We add ed, so it will be I. I what? I wait. I wait. Aren't we going to add the ed? Yes. I waited. I waited 10 minutes for the bus. Okay, the next one, Mia. He took work yesterday. He walked. Okay, walk. How do we change it to the past tense? Walked. Walked. Very good. We add what? Easy. We add Edi. He walked to work yesterday. Very good. Wait, re question four. Rewrite each sentence to tell about the future. Change the underlined verb to the future tense. Okay, the first one. My grandparents, grandparents visit us. Okay, how do we change it to the future? We'll visit. We'll visit my grandparents.
will so we add will before the verb will visit us very good next one mia kevin closed the door okay how do we change it to the future tense kevin will close the door kevin will close the door very good we crossed the ed can we write will closed no. no no it has to be the verb in its original form okay the next one danny i planted a garden how do we change it to its future tense can you see the board i will a garden so it will be I will plant a garden and again we cross the E D next one Dima she listens okay she will listen she will say it again she will listen. Listen. She will. Yes, Mia. Yes. She will listen. Okay. In the future tense, we do not add to the verb anything. Not s. Not es. Not ies. Nothing. Just we write will before the verb. Okay. Very good. Part C, question one. Write a story about your favorite sea animal. Add details. How does it look like? Where does it live? What does it do? So you think of your favorite sea animal, maybe pick a name for it, okay, and make it as a story character, and tell us what happens in the story. Mia, what's your favorite sea animal? Dolphin. Dolphin. Dima? Hassan? Dolphin. Dolphin as well. Many fans of dolphins here. Yes, Ali? Okay, Adam. The black and white whale. The black and white whale. Sea turtle. Sea turtle. Okay, Adam. Sharks. Parrotfish. Whale. Whale. Okay. Okay, yes, Selena. Clownfish. Clownfish. Very nice. Ibrahim. Pack of fish. Pack of fish. Okay. Adam. You need to think about it? Parrotfish? Yes, very nice. Okay. Now, so I'll show you a sample story or an example of how a story can be like. Okay? And you will write your own. Yes. Okay, start reading, Adam. Deep in the sea, live, start. The starfish deep in the sea. Starfish, the starfish with her friends, crab and octopus. Star is yellow and has two hands and legs. Crab is red and has many legs. And octopus has many legs. To star crab and octopus can breathe, breathe, breathe under water every day. Every day they go to sea school to learn about interesting, interest, interesting new things after school they go well. play with other fish in the coral coral reef yes they live in a beautiful and colorful sea 
very good good job Anna. so here the character the main character of the story is star what is star it's a starfish and we also described her friends crab and octopus octopus we mentioned their colors yellow and red and how many legs and uh, hands they have and what they do in the sea okay question two draw the character that you described in your writing okay so here i'm going to show you an example of a starfish drawing all right this is star the starfish Question three, write a sentence about your drawing. What sentence can I write here? I Raise your hands. Yes, Steve. I love starfish. I love starfish, okay. The starfish has colorful colors. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay, what else? Her name is Star. She is a starfish, yes. Ali. I love starfish. Okay, Nura. Okay, starfish is beautiful. A starfish has five hands and legs. Okay. Hassan? It has two legs and two hands. hands. Okay. Jood? Starfish? Starfish is a, a, is a little one. Live in water? Yes, starfish lives in water. Starfish has starfish has two legs and two hands. Okay, very good. Yes, Adam. It's like the star and beautiful. Oh, very nice. Okay, so this is the starfish. In my story, I called it star. Okay, I'll write a different sentence. All your sentences are good. Star is, her name is a Star. Star is happy because she lives in the world. Yes, in the world. or in the beautiful sea. Okay, good job grade two and good luck at the exam.